should you sell your house or should you consider actually holding on to it and making it an investment home? Since 2021, according to Zillow, 66% of people who were interested in selling their home actually investigated in what it would take to become a landlord. And as a property owner, you have two options if you're really thinking of selling. And either one, you sell, you take all that money and you apply it to the other home, or two, you're gonna get that house that you live in presently and get it all ready for a rental and then you become a landlord. Now, there's a lot of long-term wealth associated with being a landlord. However, there are things to consider in doing so. One would be regarding like, does your association or your neighborhood, is it acceptable? Um, the condition of your home, the size of your home, there's a lot of factors there um, to consider. Um, and then the biggest one, are you prepared to become a landlord? So as a landlord, it's not about collecting the money and then running to the bank. It's there's a, sometimes it can be a little time consuming. I, I'll put it nicely that way. Um, but there are so many different things to think about regarding if you're going to have vacancy, regarding you still have to pay maybe a mortgage or the insurance or the taxes, um, still the maintenance of the property. There's still things keep going because it's still your home. And so there's a lot of factors that you would have to consider if you were thinking of being a landlord. I'm proud to say I am a landlord and I'm happy to help you as a fellow professional realtor regarding helping you make that decision. So let's connect.